Hello, and welcome to this video about lightning and tornado safety. My name is Michael Warner, and I'm the Special Needs Coordinator for Madison County Aries RACES, which is Amateur Radio Emergency Services in Huntsville, Alabama. First off, let's talk about tornadoes and what is so dangerous about them. Tornadoes can literally take a house and rip it apart completely. Things that you need to look for when you're dealing with tornadoes is a loud roaring sound or darkness and clouds. Things you also need to look for is shakiness of your windows or walls. Another thing you might want to focus on when it comes to tornadoes is being able to have a plan in action should a tornado watch or warning be issued during that time of event. Plan ahead and have a weather safety kit at the ready so you have to seek shelter during the weather event. Tornadoes are nothing to fool around with as the level of the tornado can reach from EF0 to EF5. The biggest one has been an EF5, ranging from small to EF1 to EF2. These tornadoes can have hail associated with them. They can have lightning associated. They can have anything associated with them when it comes to tornadoes. That's why it's so important that you remain safety cautious during that time. The next topic is lightning. Lightning is also an interesting factor when it comes to safety. And the reason why I say that is, is that you may think that lightning is exciting to see, but in reality, it's also very deadly. Most people think that, oh, if I go to a particular location, I'll be safe. But reality is, whatever you do, don't stand next to a tree. This is one of the most deadliest ways people get killed is by standing next to a tree or also being near a metal object, such as um, areas that have like a flagpole or any of that. Another thing is when it's lightning, make sure that all your electronics are powered off. This can also cause damage to electronical devices and many other things. I myself know the total devastation of losing equipment devices during an electric storm. Most of the time, you can recover an item that is hit by lightning, but you can't recover your life. Please be sure to have a plan into action whenever a severe thunderstorm warning or watch is issued. Make sure you have a plan, make sure you have your safety kits. For more information on how to react during a watch or warning of these magnitudes, please visit www.weather Dot gov for more information on the different safety plans. I would like to thank you for watching this video, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your day.